Kardashian. to a brand new group, brand new for me, not for you. Today I'm going to be checking out Kara, Kara, for the very first time. I'm not sure how to pronounce the name. I have to see it written in Hangul, but I'm assuming it's just Kara or Kara. So I actually don't know anything about this group other than that Kuhara was a member. Um, but I like know nothing about like what sort of genre or vibes or music they put out. I know nothing. I don't. Sometimes when I do these older groups, I'm like, mm, I think I might know a song by that. Like I literally know nothing about them whatsoever. So I'm super super excited. I'm gonna be reacting to five MVs today. Um, I'm gonna be reacting to Mamma Mia, Damaged Lady, uh, Pandora, and. De and then I'm also gonna be reacting to Mister, which is a Japanese release. But it had like a lot of views, I'm assuming it's like one of their most popular songs. Um, so I'm doing that as well and yeah, I'm super super excited. Let's just go. Disclaimer, I don't like to react with captions on as I find them distracting. I like to concentrate on the music and the music production is what I like to comment on the most. When I'm looking at the words at the bottom of the screen, I'm missing parts of the song, their vocals and I'm missing parts of the MV and choreo. I'll read the lyrics later in my own time. Okay guys, couple of disclaimers before we start. Um, some of these videos might get blocked. Um, I do have a lot of trouble when it comes to blocking um, like first gen, second gen groups. Um, if a video does get blocked, I will have to re-edit and so some of the MVs might be edited to avoid the copyright. Um, they might be okay though, who knows, we shall see. I'll let you, obviously you guys will see which videos are edited. Also, I like to react to things in reverse chronological order because that's just how I do things naturally. When I'm first discovering a group, I like to just go to the newest releases first and sort of work my way sort of backwards. Let's go. We're starting off with Kara, Mamma Mia, MV. Yeah. 
this sort of 80s synth, synth. Sorry guys, I ran out of memory like as soon as the bridge hit, um, but I've run it back a little bit. I've gone back to 235, that's just for my own reference. Let's go. Now I know what the bridge sounds like a bit. <laughs> I'm so excited. Let's go, give it to me. I said this not that long ago when I reacted to Sister, but I get a little bit sort of nervous when I react to these sort of legendary groups. I'm like, ah, oh, I don't know. I just feel like I don't prepare myself enough. I feel like I should, but I never do. And then this happens. I love that so much, way more than I was expecting to. I love that. Every single thing about it. I love the instrumental, the production. You had that sort of horn section in the chorus, the brass section, the funky bass all throughout those 80s. When I say 80s, I'm in the decade, not the group. Those 80s sort of synths, that 80s sort of um, drum pad that do 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 do. It had like that sort of 80s sort of elements to it. The melodies in that pre chorus, that bridge. Just the melodies all throughout, the vocals, the choreo. You guys know I'm all about the music, but that choreo, I love that. 10 out of 10 for me. I'm excited to go to the next one, let's go. Okay guys, let's go. We now have Kara, Damaged Lady, MV, let's go. These chords, dun, 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 dun. that leg synth.
一起来看，就收集起来。等回一辈子，对不对？I was not ready. I was not prepared. I have not felt this way since I first reacted to G Friend. That feeling of whoa! I haven't heard anything like this. You know that sort of feeling, like oh, this is like it's like a discovery. I feel like a lot of K-pop does tend to sound the same. Um. And it's uh, like you know when you even first discover K-pop, you're like, "Whoa, what is this? What is this fusion of sounds?" But then you get used to all the fusions of sounds and what certain groups put out. But every now and then, you come across a group and you're like, "Whoa, what's going on? What are all these sounds hitting my eardrums?" And it's I'm trying to think. I think the last time I felt that way, like, "What is this?" It was when I reacted to G Friend, Goja Tingbu. That was superb. The fusion of sounds, like all those synths, um, those poppy sounds mixed with that sort of electric guitar, those rocky elements. Oh my god! That dun 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 again. The melodies, you guys know the most. Listen, there's like four. Th there's a few things that are the most important things to me in a song. Okay, the melodies, the chords, certain chord sequences, progressions. Okay. Um, ad libs, the pre-chorus, hello cat, and the bridge. Like those are like the most important things to me. And so far, they have had all that. That was superb. Also vocals again. Also choreo again. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with Kara. Let's go on to the next one. Okay, guys, let's go. We now have Kara, Pandora, bro. This feeling. This feeling is so good. This is what I live for, bro. This is what I live for here on my channel, bro. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Let's go, Kara, <laughs> Pandora, MV. Let's go. <laughs> this spacey synths is pads. This is making me feel nostalgic. Give me like early 2000s. Oh, I love them so much. No, I love them.
Like, I love the, the sets, the styling, like, they just look so cool. And um, again, I love the choreo, of course, but the song, the song was epic. I love that, you know the sound I mean? Again, I love the sort of fusion of sound. You had sort of those sort of heavy, rocky elements, but you also had those really nice sort of dreamy sort of synths that came in at the start. And again, for the bridge, um, again, consistent with the melodies, bro. I love the melodies that were hitting us with some vocals in this some high notes those ad libs um very very epic also i think it was during the bridge it was gonna be sort of like james bond um i was loving the sort of cool changes and sort of key changes within this song as well that was absolutely fantastic i love them so much also that one was really really catchy like a really really catchy chorus like that hook <sighs> let's go on to the next one okay guys let's go i do not want this reaction to end We've got two more left no let's go cut up Step MV. Let's go. <laughs> Hey. I'm trying to party with Kana, man. 
that move. Iconic. But nah, that has just sealed the deal. Nah, that one has just sealed the deal. That one is just still, I mean, the deal was sealed two songs ago. Three <laughs> songs ago. But that one's definitely sealed the deal. I'll tell you why. Because technically, like sound wise, like use of instrumentation and just sound wise and just vibes, that would probably be my least favourite. And I was gonna say, like, by the end of the video, I was be like, that's probably my least, the one that I vibe with the least so far. However, however, I just bro, the melodies, and I'm repeating myself, the melodies, that pre-chorus, okay, the bridge, nah, that switch up in the bridge, that was my favourite bridge so far, like, even the song that's technically supposed to be the least my vibe, um, it's a 10 out of 10 for me, it's a 10 out of 10 for me, I love that, that was so much fun as well. Again, a very, very catchy hook in the chorus, the choreo, that one iconic move, you know the move I mean. Again, we had like a brass section, the epicness, the music video, they're just vibing, they're partying. Oh, let's go on to the last one. Okay guys, I'm absolutely gutted. I'm devastated. This is about to be the last one. Let's go guys, we have the last remaining uh, track in MV, which is a Japanese one, it's called Mista, I believe, um, it's written in Japanese, obviously I can't read Japanese, um, there's, I saw there was a Korean version, but I'm doing the Japanese one, okay, let's go, oh my lord, love already, no, I love already, That 
whole thing. <laughs> The choreo, the little booty move, the booty move, the booty move. That whole thing, again, the melodies, bro. The synths, the bass, that moment where we had the beat cut out and we had electric guitar and bass. That whole thing. Nah, I'm obs I love them. Oh my God. Bro, you know that feeling when you discover something incredible? I love them so much. I did not expect to love them as much as I do. Snakery, I mean, you guys have been requesting them for a while, and a lot of you did try and warn me, but I can't pick a favorite. Usually, I like to try and pick a favorite. I don't think I can pick a favorite today. I don't think I can pick a favorite. I can't. I can't pick a favorite. I can't do it. If I can't pick a favourite, then you know. I've got nothing else to say. Let me know what MVs they have left. I'm going to react to them again soon. Real soon. I might even fuck around and do something crazy and just react to all their B-sides as well. I might even do a guide. Like, <laughs> so much I love Kara. I'm even joking. Like, that's how much I love them. Bro. Just let me know what other MVs and I'll do another marathon. I don't know how many they have left. Just let me know. Leave a comment and I'll react to them as soon as I can. As soon as I have time, as soon as I have a free spot, I'm giving it to them. I don't care. I'm obsessed. I've got nothing else to say. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, subscribe if you haven't subscribed. If you have subscribed, I love you. I love you. Gonna follow me on Instagram. Just gonna follow me on Twitter. And yeah. Goodbye. Oh!